Muay Thai has given me a perspective of life that I don't, I don't know if I would have been handled this situation as good as I have been without Muay Thai because uh, literally I look at it as like I'm in a fight camp for life though, you know what I'm saying? We are just honored that everybody is uh, taking part in uh, supporting John and uh, we're going to have a great time today. If you haven't got a wristband, uh, definitely uh, beat up on that kid over there and try to pin him and I'm sure they'll fall out of his pockets or something. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> when I went to um, Frito Butter, I was actually using the I feel great. Um, I just can't believe this amount of support I've been getting um, and still get. And uh, I'm just very thankful for everybody, you know. Um, it really means a lot to me that, you know, everybody cares so much. I've been training a little over 10 years now. Um, I actually started fighting out of the Institute um, and then I took a little bit of a break for four years and then I came back. All the training and preparing and walking and I'm doing right now is going to get me back to the place I was at before with my actual legs and uh, it's giving me that, that strong mindset that uh, I'm very thankful for and I'm so glad I got involved in this sport and it's given me so many connections to good people that uh, I would never trade in for the world. I started working with Chris Strand and uh, Weapons 9 and uh, yeah I still plan on fighting for them once you know I get back in the fighting shape and hopefully amputee boxing, you know? I'm here for John Esposito. He's become a part of our gym, but also he's a huge part of our community. Um, I'm so blessed to know him. The inspiration and the amazing uh, attitude that he has towards the horrific events that changed his life um, has left everybody in this community inspired. And um, I'm so happy to be able to be a part of uplifting him. And But most of all, he's uplifting the community itself. It's just amazing to see everybody come out like this. It's been like really inspiring to see uh, the support that he's got and uh, everybody doing this together. And John has just been an inspiration to everybody with, with, what he's done, with what he's done and how far he's gonna go. I mean, this is just the beginning. We're only a year out from, uh, you know, from what happened and uh, it's just, it's amazing what he's done. And today we were all a part of it and we were here with him when he's gone farther than he ever has on, on the prosthetics and it's only gonna get better from here. I'm thrilled to be part of this event, to have all of the wonderful people that came through, showed their heart in training and walking with us and making donations. I just feel really blessed because John is an absolutely amazing human being, and I can't wait to see all the big things he will continue to do, so. His spirit is strong, and uh, everybody needs to hear his story because it's so inspiring, and it, look, it's uh, inspiring for me, and like, we all need that reminder that sometimes we're gonna, you know, we're gonna face huge setbacks in life, but we, we can always look at it in two different ways. We can use it to hold us back, or we can use it to move us forward and become stronger. It's really amazing to see somebody go through something that they have no control over and to get back up and keep going at it. So thank you for being an inspiration and don't give up even when it gets hard. Thank you. What I noticed about you is your smile, man. You know, just keep smiling. You already like won like half or almost the, all the battle. Uh, just keep that smile up. You're inspiring me. I know you inspired everyone, other, everyone here. Um, it's, really, it's really a blessing to see you keep on um, just being happy. 
Uh, I just briefly met you, man, but just from what I've been hearing and, and seeing, just you've been so inspirational, all of us in, in our team, and just really glad I got to meet you and, you know, keep that spirit up, man, and hopefully one day we could, we could throw hands. I'm looking forward to it, man. Keep the spirit up. I just want to say that you're very inspiring. Um, stay strong, and we're always here for you. Take care. I met you this morning for the first time. I always say you're a wonderful guy, and uh, it was nice to spend a nice, beautiful day out hiking and training. Uh, and I hope to see you continue down your path with Muay Thai, uh, and I hope the best for you. Take care. I just want to give some shout outs. Like I said, uh, Liam Tarrant, uh, Chris Romulo, Sarah Romulo, uh, Chris Tran, all have been there and just they're good people and they've been great supporters and uh, I can't thank them enough. That they just do this for me because they're good people, you know? And uh, I, I, like I said, I just can't say thank you enough. It's crazy, yeah.